Yo, what's going on, guys? This is Insult Gaming here, and today I'm going to bring you a um, a Remington R5 best class setup. Um, I've been wanting to do this for a while. Um, I've actually been using the Remington R5 a lot lately, um, and I've noticed that it's actually a pretty sweet gun. Um, so, uh, yeah, I decided to bring you guys the best class setup, my favorite best class setup for. Uh, for this weapon, so uh, in this clip here, I think I'm playing on containment. Uh, like my clips are containment, and then and then uh, tremor and and one other one. But um, my first best class setup it is. Um, so I'm really excited for it. Um, it's been lots of fun. All my uh, all my commentaries I've been doing have been live. So uh, yeah, so. Uh, I'm really excited for this. It's gonna be uh, awesome, lots of fun. So um, let's jump. Uh, let's jump right into this best class setup. So um, here, as you may be able to see on the screen, uh, on the gameplay, I am using the Remington R5, of course, with a silencer and a red dot. Because uh, I'll get into this in a sec. Okay, so I have the silencer and a red dot on, and you'll notice that this is a very it looks like I'm almost rushing in this gameplay, but I'm playing more. I'm I'm having a oh yeah in Bayview. I'm having a defensive, defensive way to it. Um, and um, like I I'm playing defensively, and to be honest, this it's you're not gonna go rush out with the Remington R5 all the time and and just kill everyone. You know you can use support, um, but I'll, I'll get into uh, I'll get into why I'm using. You know, some playing drops on here too, um, but right now I'll get into why I'm using uh, silencer and red dot. I'll get into all that later. So first of all, silence because you need to, in my opinion, if you don't have a silencer on this thing, it's like do 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 do, and then you're on the radar so easy, and then people can hear you from halfway across the map shooting your gun, like or all the way across the map. You're like do 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 because the Remington R5 is so loud. Um, so that's one reason why I put a silencer, um, and especially with the defensive, the defensive way, it really, it really works nicely. Now, um, the second reason I put a silencer is because it reduces the muzzle flash, and then you're just gonna go, um, oh, well then, use the muzzle break, but no, because, because, um, like I said, you know, you don't want to be heard from all the way across the map, um, and you want to stay off the radar, so, a couple reasons why I use a silencer. Now the red dot, I'll get in a little bit because I use the red dot because really the red dot versus the iron sights is a no-brainer. I mean, yeah, you could probably do with the iron sights, but you know you won't be as accurate when you have the red dot. When you have that reduced muzzle flash, it's just an absolute beast. Um, and talk about the damage. Oh, this gun has insane damage. So insane damage so when you take and you put a silencer it won't affect it it won't affect it that much it will at longer ranges but it, you put a silencer red dot you can see clearly and you're accurate boom you take them down so easy when I go up against a Remington R5 and I'm using like any an SMG I am screwed because it's like like you're dead and that is the great thing about the Remington but it does have a slower rate of fire so, um, and there I ran out of ammo, but, um, it, it is a great gun. Um, so for my perks, I went for extra lethal because, and the IEDs, those are essential. Those are so awesome for this class. And you might be saying, oh, I didn't use none. And because I know you get more perks if you don't use the IEDs or the lethals or whatever, but I'm telling you, they really help with this class. You see how much I've probably already got like. In this in this gameplay alone, I already like in the last one, I already got like 20 kills just in that like in that clip from or, not 20, like two kills each life from the IED, which is awesome. Um, and it really it really goes with the defensive playstyle, and th and that's what I like about it. Um, you'll see here I'm patrolling the area, and that works great with the IEDs, just absolutely awesome. Um, so also I went for amplify, also with that defensive playstyle. Because, um, so you can hear the footsteps. That's just, if you don't use a mic too often or uh, anything like that, just, you can always switch that out. 
um, for any other perk like sleight of hand, um, sleight of hand, blind eye, uh, you know, focus. I also put on stalker because I like even when I do get in those close range gun battles, and this is amazing damage. So I figure if I can strafe maybe a little bit, I've I've got this. I've got this, and and I'll win that gunfight. So that's what I love about that. And quick draw because um, I think. You can substitute quick draw. You don't really need it with this class, but I like it because when I get in those close gunfights like that, example right there. If I didn't have quick draw, and it also works well with stalker as well. Um, so um, that's pretty much that's pretty much it uh, for my assault uh, or <laughs> for my score streaks or kill streaks. I use the assault package, um, rocking the IMS sentry gun and battle hind. Because, well, here I'm playing Drop Zone. Um, and Drop Zone's a great mode to play with this gun. Um, because if you're silenced and you're playing Drop Zone, they have no idea where you are and they expect you to be at the Drop Zone. Um, if you've seen uh, my past videos. So, um, Drop Zone and Kill Confirmed is a great ma mode to play. Domination? Yeah, but I'd recommend Kill Confirmed or, or Drop Zone um, as th with this class. So, um,. I'm rocking the assault because obviously you're gonna play a little more defensive, so I figure that works great with that with that strategy, the IEDs, all that stuff. It's just awesome. Um, so um, yeah, you know, that, that pretty much explains it. I will have a picture of uh, a screenshot of of my class here at the, at the end of the video. Um, so um, yeah, you know that's. That's that's just awesome. I, I absolutely love this gun um, for the damage, the um, everything. It's just it's just such an amazing gun. Now, if you do want to switch out like a silencer, you could do that. I'd keep the red dot sight though, um, and then I'd put on off the grid if you are gonna switch out the silencer, because yeah, you're gonna be seen. You're gonna be seen. Um, but uh, overall, overall, I, I, oh look at that! That was my jump knife. <laughs> I didn't even mean to do that, but I did. Um, but overall, I love this gun. Um, it's actually one of my favorite assault rifles. Now in here, I picked up, I ran out of ammo, so I tried to find a Remington on the ground. So I just picked up a Ripper that someone had, and uh, decided to decided to continue my streak. And I think here I ended up picking up an MTAR. I'm sorry, guys. I. I know it's a Remington R5 video, but um, I, I do find one at the end, but that's it. So I go on, I go on a streak here, like pick up the MTAR and just go like rushing around everywhere. <laughs> and there's where Amplify comes in handy, right there. I heard him at the last second or else I would have died. I'm not kidding, that was so in handy. So I'm just like rushing around with the MTAR here and then <gasps> Remington R5. And then, and then like I pick it up, start running. All right, let's get some uh, get some Remington gameplay, and then all of a sudden, uh, end of the video. Um, but I really do hope you guys enjoyed. Um, that was my first uh, best class setup video. Um, if you want me to do more, I'll do some more. There's my class right there. Um, but thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I will see you on my next video. Peace.